Winter Packers, it's Ruby. Usually I'm pretty busy, but it's winter break, which means it's the perfect time to sit back, relax, and watch my favorite shows on Netflix. I don't know why I'm, okay, I'm just gonna set that right there. I don't know why I was holding that. There is literally so much to stream. And I should know as an expert of multiple accounts, I have Netflix, I have Amazon, I do have Hulu, but my mom won't give me the password into the account. But I figure that sometimes if I just sit at home in my homemade Snuggie, watching Netflix or Amazon or Hulu, it can get kind of boring or repetitive. So I came up with some awesome hacks to make watching TV even more fun. All right, it's time to hack your world. So our first hack is this DIY show chooser. Now, I don't know about you, but I am super indecisive, especially because Netflix and all those other streaming apps are giving me too many options. So I've created my very own brick and mortar, old school algorithm. All you have to do is choose your options, spin the wheel, and it will tell you exactly what to watch. Let's hack it. For this DIY, I used an old record, chalkboard paint, a game spinner, spray paint, and chalk. I started by painting my record with chalkboard paint. Next, I painted the spinner piece to make it stand out. When the paint was dry, I attached a spinner to the middle of my record. Finally, I wrote some show categories to choose from and gave my show chooser a spin. Our next hack is Wickle Wickle Wow! It's this awesome turntable serving tray. It's really easy, I mean, to make and to use, and it looks super cool. But let's say I want Oreos, but I'm like, I don't want Oreos. I want Lay's, or I want Cheetos, or I want Tootsie Rolls. I can just keep on going while making sick meat. I kind of stole some of my parents' old records for this one, so please don't tell them. Let's hack it. For this DIY, I started out with a wooden board, two records, plastic bowls, crafting felt, drawn crafting glue, a paper straw, and some craft essentials from my Goldie Blocks toolkit. I actually decided to paint the board to add a pop of color first. Then I placed my two records down, measured to make sure they were center, and traced around the edges. Next, I took my crafting felt and marked where the center hole in the record would be. Then cut a hole. For this next part, I was going to use small pieces of the paper straw to spin the records on, but then I changed my mind and thought push pins would work a lot better instead. I spread glue and hammered the push pins into the center of each trace circle. Then I fixed my crafting felt to the board and placed the records on top. Then it was time to add the bowls. At first, I thought I'd just glue them down, but I ended up using small pieces of command strip to hold them in place. And after some trial and error, voila, a perfect snackable serving tray. For our next hack, you may have been wondering what I've been wearing this whole time. It's a DIY Snuggie. It's very beautiful, very long and luscious, kind of like a Met Gala, you know, vibe. Like I could probably wear this to the Met Gala. Super duper duper amazingly, amazingly comfortable. And Probably my favorite hack I've ever done. Wow, this Snuggie is the most comfortable thing I've ever had. Much better than a blanket because my arms are warm. Let's hack it. For this DIY, I used two colors of fleece fabric, scissors, and some sewing pins from my Goldie Blocks Craft Essentials Toolkit. First, I layered my fleece colors on top of each other. I used sewing pins to keep the layers all lined up. I cut a half circle out the center where my head would go. Then I cut half circles out the top two corners from my arms. Next, I cut strips of fabric along the top edge of my fabric. I tied each strip of the top layer to its match on the bottom layer and made sure to double knot. Then, I made strips all down the two sides of the fleece. You can even measure to make sure that the strips are all the same size. I tied those strips together and tried it on for size. And check it out, a Snuggie I can literally spend all day streaming in. Or 
maybe I should go outside at some point. Thanks for watching! If you enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you never miss any of our hacks. And comment down below what you're watching right now! Well, not right now, because you're watching this hack along. Duh! If you want to get your own toolkit, unicorn pillow, or any of the other Goldie Blocks maker kits, make sure you go to goldieblocks.com or Amazon. Ruby Rose, signing off. Bye!